secret on how to cook the perfect adobong mani every time. Here are the simple ingredients. 500 grams peanuts, 3 cloves garlic sliced, oil, and salt. So what's the secret? Just put the ingredients all together in the pan even if the oil is not yet hot. So at this point, I'm filling up the pan. Don't wait for it to heat up. Just put the garlic and put the peanuts right after. The second secret in this recipe is your garlic. Why? Because the garlic will serve as your indicator if the peanuts are ready. So once you put everything together, you cook it on high fire for about a minute, a minute or two, just, you know, to bring up the temperature of the oil to a hot and then you cook it for 10 minutes into a medium heat for about 10 minutes. So stir it from time to time because otherwise you will burn the peanut. As I mentioned earlier, your garlic is your indicator to know when the peanuts are ready. Once the garlic is cooked, you just need to strain the oil from the pan and put it in a bowl. You can use a strainer and that will be easier for you. Just be careful because the oil is really hot. You might burn yourself while you're straining it, so just make sure you're very careful. Now, when you see that the garlic is already brown, it means that the peanuts are ready to be strained. So just take it off the pan and strain the oil and it will be ready. Now, don't worry because when you taste the peanuts at that point, when you strain it, it's still slightly uncooked. But the peanuts temperature will remain hot and that will continue the cooking until it's ready. So that will give you the perfectly cooked peanut every single time. If you follow the secrets I shared with you on cooking the perfect adobong mani, you will have a perfect adobong mani every single time. And you will not have burnt peanuts ever. Because again, the, the mistake of most people is, you know, they, they fry the garlic, they remove it, they put the peanuts, and they don't know when it's cooked. So again, you just cook it all together until it reaches this point when it's ready to be strained, and then you're done. Now, after you strain the peanuts from the pan, don't forget to add your salt. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Shaksticksai. Until next, bon appetit!